let's start. <clears throat> I'm gonna be going in with Take Me to a Brazil palette because you know it has a lot of colors, lots of bright colors. So it looks like this. Oh my god. I'm black. We're gonna go in with this one. And I'm just gonna take it on the crease. So once I packed all the color on the crease, I'm just going to be blending up. Do this same to the other eye. And you're done. Cute. Just kidding. I've been seeing, I saw, I don't know if you guys know her, well if you do, cool. But Trisha Paytas is with Jacqueline Hill's husband. Or at least they posted on Instagram. I was like, we started off 2020 crazy. This color. Okay, color, where are you? Because you are getting chalky on me. Okay, so I have an idea. I'm just going to pack this on. So it does kind of look like, you know, a fade. That's what I was going for. So I'm just packing it on. Okay, so I'm going in with the fluffy brush and picking up the purple. And just running it up the crease. So just blend and blend. And don't stop blending, okay? A rose, a rose gold glitter. <laughs> so look at what we're gonna use. We're gonna use this thing. I hope this is glue. It looks like glue. Looks gooey. Oh, it's still bright. Okay, maybe we'll just do the whole eyelid. Maybe not. Okay. So I'm just gonna step on the glue. Ooh. Ooh, I like it. Place the glue all over. Oh, you know, girl, I don't. I I just don't be having techniques. I just be doing this stuff. Okay, so make sure you let it get tacky. The glitter, since it's like more on the. Chunkier side. Oh, 
the darker purple shadow. See if we can intensify the look. Same on this eye. I'm just running it in the outer corners. Then I'm going in with some black on the outer. Just a tad bit. And I'm blending that all the way. Okay, and when we are ready, we're just gonna peel them. Baby girl! <laughs> Did we forget to mention? Oh my god. Ooh. I'm using my primer. This is a monostat. This is chaff chaffing cream. If you don't know what that is, if you don't know what that is, it's like when you a big girl and yo. This is one thigh, this is one thigh. And it creates money, you know? Just kidding. It's just like when you're a big girl, like me, and your thighs rub together, and then like, say like you're in Disneyland, and you've been walking around town for seven hours already. Girl, I know your thighs, your thighs be burning. So this like is like a, a relief because it's like a very velvety feeling so it makes it like not rub no more. So this is what I use on my face. It has no scent, no nothing. Literally feels like the Smashbox primer. This is like $5 for I'm using my Milk Cosmetics Mascara. This was sent to me buy milk um, through my influencer account. So this, I'm sorry, sorry. They also sent me this, which is a serum for your lashes. So it's just like a, like a serum, jelly, consistency. And you put it on your lashes or eyebrows and it's supposed to make them grow. Has, has no scent to it. And these are like high-end products. I mean, they're made in Italy, so. This one, I'm gonna be honest, I did put it on my eyelashes. I think I put it too close to my eyes so it started burning, so. I never used it again. But this mascara. Let's just talk about the packaging. The packaging is so good, like it's heavy, it's pretty good. So, I'm gonna go in. I'm not curling my eyelashes. I would if I had a eyelash curler. I just don't know where it went. Guys, I'm so sorry, my camera died, so. I'm back, so my uh, my big announcement, it's not big, people know about this, but YouTube doesn't, so. So I do have my own lash brand. This is what they look like. It's Tati Chanel Lashes. So I have like a marble case with rose gold glitter, and then you open them. And then I do have names on them. This is hashtag. <coughs> this one is um, hashtag twerk team. Really pretty. These are the ones I'm going to wear today. So this is my second collection. This one was my first ever um, 
Flashbox. Um, as you can see, as you can see, it has the same name, everything, black, metallic rose gold, and these were called baddies. Super natural, super pretty. I have um, ten different styles. I am currently sold out. I only have twerk team and sugar daddy left. If you guys are interested and want to see pictures, you can go to my nail page, and um, I have my pictures there. And you could DM me, and we could send out orders and stuff. I do have an online website, but I'm currently working on that again. Very wispy on this side. Very cute. And also, guys, I do have my own beauty blender. So they come in boxes like this. Tati Chanel. And then in the back in that, it has like my own little note on how to take care of the brush of the brush of the blender. This is not the regular blender like like this. It is a microfiber. So it's basically a brush and a blender together. I do love this one. I love my blenders. If you are interested, you can DM me and you could get one. I have it in gray and pink. And yes, these are, you could use them wet as well. You know, don't you just get really hyped when you like. And you just like, cute. So this is how I do it. So this is the package. I, I bend the thing this way. So then the lashes like are hanging out. And then I pull from the middle. Like I don't sleep, you know. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Who takes me? So the lashes are on. You like it? It's so cute, you know? All dirty. In the color toasted coconut. And I literally pumped like one on each. Let's bring out my blender. Guys, when I tell you this does not soak up any, any foundation, I'm telling you. It doesn't soak up foundation like a like a blender. But you know how brushes leave streaks? So this is when the blender part comes in. But the brush doesn't absorb foundation. So it's a two-in-one. I highly recommend. And it just blend all the way down. Sorry, I put more. Yo, stop texting me. I love. So that's one pump of foundation. On each, I could probably go less. Did 
you can see I do like bring it all the way over here. I absolutely love this foundation. I see some girls that do makeup and you know, do it very like, girl, I'm just like, you know. Then I'm gonna cut my eyeshadow. I'm gonna cut my eyeshadow. I'm going with the regular one. Just because here I don't like it very intense. Around my nose, just you know, just like it regular. Oh, it just blends so good. So then I'm going to use the flat side of my blender, pick up some, and it applies the powder intensely. I love it. Like, look. Let it set for a little. Then we're gonna dust my Morphe M581. And I'm going in with the Physicians Formula Bronzer and Deep Bronzer. It smells so good. You know, I'm just gonna. Bronze yourself so trying to cover my five head. I'm taking the BH Cosmetics brush, metallic -y, and then I'm going in with this one and then just really contour the uh me. I personally like a very like Cause you know, girl, I have a double chin. I have big cheeks. You know, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a big girl. So I need to act like, you know, at least my face is thin. So here we go again with the darker one. Go in with my Mac Whisper of Guilt with my Morphe brush i love this highlighter brush it's a m510 as you can see it looks disgusting Taking this pink right here, the same one we use for the top. And I'm going in. My God, this tickles me so bad. The Kylie Jenner gloss.
we are all done so i hope you guys enjoyed my little tutorial i'm sorry that my camera died well you guys won't know but my camera died um but other than that i think this look came out really really cute i love my eyes i just love glitter just came out super pretty so thank you guys so much for watching um hold on it's not well it's a little sticky but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i really do appreciate you make sure you subscribe like and comment anything you want no not anything but you know comment what other videos you guys would like to see also follow me on my social media my instagram my nail page you can follow me on facebook facebook's more for family but you know not snapchat don't don't do that not snapchat but other than that thank you guys so much muchos besitos para todos and i hope you guys enjoy this look 